seven and a half miles a day. It's probably a more efficient way to do this, but this is how I always do it. Because if I try doing it like this, my calf isn't completely relaxed, but when I hang it off like that, nice and relaxed. The back of my car is literally just all football, soccer stuff. But we got the GoPro mount, the chest mount. All right, we are on the way to the track. What's nice about this track is that it's literally like three minutes away from my apartment. Not too terrible of a drive, not gonna lie. Okay, we're here guys and this is gonna be my first time trying one of these chew things. Um, so these are meant to energize you before and throughout your run. I, there's like two of these. So I'm gonna take one before I run and then like midway through to see how I feel. I'm excited to try them. I don't know if it's gonna be like a gummy, gummy bear flavor or whatever. Let, let's see. Got the running shoes, the Brooks. These are awesome. Take off the Crocs. All right, we're out on the field. We've got the GoPro strapped on. That's how we're gonna be recording me actually running. Let's see how I do with running with the GoPro. I don't think it would be heavy. I mean, it's this thing doesn't weigh anything. But I'll update you guys every mile. Well, actually, let's try the gummies. So it looks like it's each individual square. Interesting. Smells good. That tastes pretty good, not gonna lie. All right, let's get this run started. How's this angle? This part can be a blessing or a curse. This is downhill. Once we get to the end, it's an uphill. Also, we're going at conversation pace this whole, this whole run today. 7.5 miles. Just finished one mile. See that? One mile down, nine minutes, 55 seconds. Nothing crazy, just conversation pace. All right, I would consider this the harder part just because there's no shade. I mean, this fence is shade, but you know what I mean, no tree shade. Also, I got sweat in my eye. Two miles, 1021. Me updating you every mile. It's just because I don't want my batteries to die. Then I have no footage at all. So every mile, I swear they need to make white GoPros because these black ones, since it's hot outside, the battery drains so easily. Three miles in, 10.59. Four miles, 10.50. We're going all the way down there and then back. Just switched up the GoPro batteries, finishing up my gummies. It's a hot day today. It's like 85-ish. I am in the shade, so it feels nice. But whenever I run in the sun, holy cow, it's like running in the desert. But got about three and a half miles left. Let's do it. Fourteen forty-nine. Damn, that's a long mile. Six 
six miles, 11.53. Twelve fifty-five. Half a mile left to go. Let's go. And done. Oh. Whew. Let's start our walk. Oh man. So just finished up the run. Not gonna lie. I am very tired. Should have came on this run like an hour and a half earlier than what I did because. The sun is at its, uh, where is it? I don't even know where it's at. But it's at its peak right now, the only shade, it's actually the most shaded area of the trail. But I'm just over here making excuses. Oh, we got seven and a half miles done. I think it was 70, 80 minutes, somewhere around there. So pretty average. Not gonna lie, it felt kind of nice running with a GoPro. If you were on the same trail I was running on and I pass you, this is how I look like. Got a fanny pack, GoPro, got so much weight on me, you know? The fanny pack and GoPro is like about 50 pounds just in total, so train hard. But I'm gonna walk back to the car, get home, do an ice bath. I recently just started doing ice baths, so. And by ice bath, I mean just super cold water because I don't have enough ice. Well, I can have enough ice. I just need to go out to like Chick-fil-A or something and buy some ice or the gas station, fill the tub up with ice. But if you know anything about training, it's like 50 training, 50% 50 training, 50% recovery. Recovery is very important. And that includes stretching, ice baths, even recovery workouts, like just walking like I am now and sleep. Sleep is very important, which I need to do better about because I sometimes stay up till one, two in the morning editing videos, but yeah, let's get home and take a nice ice bath. I'm just kidding. Max weighs like two pounds.